Visual highlights on the new car include LED lights front and rear, a longer bonnet and narrowed A-pillars for improved visibility. The car rides on 18 or 19 IN alloy wheels and sits higher than the current model. The fifth-generation mid-sized SUV has an all-new platform and features turbocharged powertrain options for the first time. Wider, and with a longer wheelbase, it has more sculpted styling than the current CRV, and reflects Honda's desire to make the car a more premium product than its predecessor. A Honda UK spokesman previously suggested to Autocar that the new CRV represents a bid to rival more premium products such as the Land Rover Discovery Sport and Volvo XC60. The CRV is a massive pillar for us, he said. I'm not sure that HRV in the UK will ever become a four wheel drive car, most people in this segment will vote with their feet and buy two wheel drive. So if we can assume that HRV will only ever be two-wheel drive, then you've got to come up with a different proposition with the CRV. Can we compete with Land Rover as a brand? That's less about CRV and more about Honda as a brand. Inside the new CRV, Honda promises class leading space and rear legroom, with better quality materials and more intricately stitched seats. Rear passengers get a volume control for the sound system, while up front there's the option of a 7.0 in screen running an Android operating system with SAT NAV, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Other features include a hands-free tailgate, operated by a wave of a foot under the rear bumper, while a myriad of safety features have helped the car towards achieving a 5-star rating in US crash tests.